Uh, yes, today is a very important day for both myself and all the members of our contingent who have travelled from Canada. We've spent two weeks here in the Netherlands and we've been very touched by the reception we've received from the Dutch people. Uh, I feel very proud to be Canadian and to have seen and witnessed firsthand the work that my grandfather uh, did here in the Netherlands 70 years ago. But I'm also very grateful to the Dutch people that they have put so much time and effort into remembering their past. Welcome all of this is a begraaf place. Welcome here to join us on the seminary. Today is 70 years ago, Holt was free. 70 jaar bevrijding. 70 jaar vrede. Zondag 8 april 1945. Gevechten rondom Holte. De bevrijders komen eraan. Een zondag in april. S'nachts 3 graden, overdag 13 graden, zoals vandaag. Hoe gaat het die dag? De spanning. Wanneer zijn we vrij? In de loop van de avond eindelijk vrij. Het Wilhelmus zal geklonken hebben en zal zijn gefeest. Maar de Duitsers waren nog steeds dichtbij. In Wierden, in Hellendoorn, in Rijssen. Those who fought in the liberation of the Netherlands achieved and sacrificed much. More than 7,600 Canadians died in the nine months it took to liberate the Netherlands, a tremendous sacrifice in the cause of freedom. Today, we recognize the sacrifices and achievements of all those who fought in the liberation of the Netherlands, who accomplished so much and left a lasting legacy of peace. Thank you for remembering Canada's soldiers and thank you for today's moving ceremony. Thank you. As the Deputy Commander of the Royal Netherlands Army, I truly regard it an honor and a privilege to be part of this commemoration. Currently, the mission of the Royal Netherlands Army is to fight for peace and security and defend our freedom, if needed, both at home and abroad. To the Netherlands, General Van Oom, keep them rolling. All I can say is thank you, thank you, Thank you, thank you well. The reception we've received from the Dutch people, they've been very warm and have embraced us uh, all along the way. We've celebrated now uh, four different commemorations uh, as part of the Keep Them Rolling organization. The first one was in Sirenburg approximately a week ago and uh, we've just been so touched uh, with the, the warmth that the Dutch people have shown us here. It's been a very special trip for all of us.